Happening now, thousands of people are still without power this morning after Hurricane Helene. Georgia Power says more than 370,000 customers statewide are in the dark right now. News 3's Genevieve Lund is live downtown with the latest on restoration efforts. Genevieve, good morning. Good morning, Ben and Kim. More than 60,000 Georgia Power customers in Chatham County are still without electricity. And while these numbers have been improving, we could be days away from a full restoration. As of a few hours ago, Georgia Power officials say Hurricane Helene was the most destructive hurricane in the company's history. More than 5,000 poles need to be repaired, along with 500 transformers. And on top of that, 1,500 trees need to be removed to restore power statewide. Georgia Power estimates restoration times for most of the area to be late tomorrow night. You want to avoid any downed power lines. You want to make sure you don't try to remove any tree limbs or avoid any standing water, things that could possibly be energized that may not look like it. Now here's a closer look at the outage numbers this morning around Georgia, along with Chatham County's 62,000, more than 13,000 people don't have power in Effingham County, 9,000 people in Bullock County are in the dark, and along with thousands in Liberty and Bryan counties. And as for South Carolina, thousands still don't have power there. 2,900 Dominion customers in Beaufort County are not online yet, and 2,500 are without power in Hampton County, and just about 1,600 in Jasper County. And you can get more information about your power outage in your area on our website. Check out WSAV.com. Reporting downtown at City Hall, Genevieve Lund, WSAV News 3, on your side. Thank you, Genevieve. Chatham County has extended their state of emergency through this Friday following the impact of Hurricane Helene. The extension will allow for continued recovery efforts and assessments across the county. Now, if you do need assistance, SEMA says they are currently having issues with their phone number. In a post on X, they advise anyone in need of help to call their non-emergency number instead. That's 912-652-6500. The city of Savannah is working to handle all the debris and power outages from the storm. Essential emergency services like public safety, storm water, and traffic engineering are among those still available. The city's water resources reports no major issues with the drinking water supply system. Debris removal begins today. It is expected to continue for the next few weeks. If you have a service request, the city reminds you to visit their website or use the SAV 311 app. 5.33, it is Monday.